Just Hi, it's Trunk from MonsterMonsters.com and I'm here today to show you what you're going to get when you order a package from us from MonsterMonsters.com You're going to get a uh, Vivo uh, monitor stand, it comes with the manual So this is the, uh, the stand and then the arm the arm is rated to hold up to 27 inches of uh, monitor screen and up to 100 pounds. Here is the base that's going to go on your computer, that's going to sit on your computer desk. The base is very sturdy. Uh, it's not a clamp. Uh, other people don't like the clamp because it's too close to the wall. With the uh, base, you can move it around your desk and uh, you can just adjust it to how, many, how, how much space you need on your desk. Um, the monitor stands are a Dell monitor stand. These are the uh, P24, uh, 24 inches uh, LCD monitor. Uh, they have the bracket already put on them just for convenience so when you open the box you'll be able to put this together and put it on the stand in no time. Here's just the second monitor. So these come with the DVI cables for the monitors and the power cords. And for a little bit extra, you can uh, get the sound bar that will attach to the monitor themselves, uh, which I, I can show you in a few minutes. And the uh, uh, display hub, uh, th this will eliminate the, u the need for any adapters. It's just uh, a universal display hub that will uh, be connected via USB. So if your laptop doesn't have uh, the right connection, you can just hook up your monitors to the, the, this hub and hook up the USB cord to the um, laptop and it will display the video on the screen. So now I'm going to go ahead and set up the stand. The, uh, the base has three screws on the bottom and um, you just have to align it to the hole and then use the little tool to um, screw it in. and then you can place it anywhere on your desk. Uh, with the arm, you have to flex it back to the front. You'll know which direction that uh, you need the arm to face by the little, um, uh, the little screw on the top. These will fasten the monitor to the stand so that they don't uh, lift up uh, whenever you touch them and fall out. And then another thing is that the, the bracket stopper should be on the bottom because this is how you're going to slide the, the monitor into it with the bracket sliding down like that and then it will stop. So go ahead and put this on the stand and wiggle it down to the uh, preferred height. And then you're going to use the big tool to uh, tighten the arm together. And then make sure it doesn't slip anymore. So now it's tight. So what you want to do is uh, bend the arm so that um, 
this is uh, facing uh, straight so that way you can line the bracket up with the uh, bracket over here now you have to be careful with uh, balancing the monitor because uh, one side is going to be heavier than the other one so what you want to do is you want to put them on with one one arm and then hold the uh, stand with the other one kind of like that see so it's going to tilt but you can adjust the arm so now it's in center of balance and it won't fall down and then you have to fasten the little the um, mini screw now you're going to do the same to the other one and then make sure that when you when you uh, put it on that um, it doesn't tip over And that's it. Now you can make your adjustments. So if you want the monitor curve, more curved in, or if you want to um, tilt it up or tilt it down, or if you want to turn it sideways. Um, th this is the, the base uh, product, um, but you can order a uh, display hub. Uh, the display hub is so that uh, you don't have to use any adapters. Uh, if your laptop only has one adapter and you want to use the, our dual monitor setup, um, it would be recommended to get the hub because it's a universal hub and it just plug into the USB and then it will work every time you plug it in. And then the, the great thing about the hub is that it set up your workstation. So what if you have a uh, working computer that you got from work and you have your personal computer but you want to use both, uh, both computer with the monitor stands. So this is, your, um, this is how you set up your workstation is by hooking up everything to the uh, display hub and then every time you plug into uh, whatever device you plug into the USB on your display hub um, it will um, activate and then it would work uh, with that device um, like your monitors, like your uh, keyboard and mouse, uh, like your audio uh, things um, this is an additional to uh, everything that you can get. It's called the uh, Dell Audio Bar and it just attached to the back of the uh, monitor. Uh, like so. Uh, this, this end will go into your computer or your dock. And then uh, this end is the power end, and um, it goes into your monitors because your monitor will power these up when you plug in your monitors. Uh, you have your DVI cables. So now we're going to hook up the power cable and the DVI cables. Alright, I'm going to turn them around and then I'm going to show you how 
it's hooked up to a laptop. I have an example laptop right here. Normally these connectors would go into your PC or your laptop, but if you chose the uh, dock option or the USB hub option, you just plug them into the back of your USB hub. And then simply plug in your USB uh, cable to the USB port on the laptop. And then it's just um, simply as um, logging into your computer. And then Windows would take care of the drivers for you because right now it's part of the Windows update. Match it. Now you can close the lid if you want to, and uh, you can st use this as a workstation. I don't have that set up on my laptop right now, uh, but uh, what you normally do is go into the power option, and then tell it uh, when you uh, shut down the lid, then um, don't put the computer to sleep. And then that way you can use the monitors um, and then you can close the lid and put uh, the laptop somewhere else. There you go. <laughs> now that you guys are professional at setting up your dual monitor setup, uh, what if we mix it up a little bit and throw another dual monitor setup and this is called a quad monitor setup or a quad monster setup. So you just attach it like so. But what about the cabling? Well, with the um, video, with the uh, video display hub, uh, you're able to daisy chain. Uh, if you don't know what daisy chain is, it means that you're able to connect it connect one to another one and keep connecting it called in a daisy chain manner. So you just take the USB cord that you normally plug into your laptop and you plug it into the back of the um, video display hub. Then you make sure you turn it on. And that's it. Voila. It's magic. There's a lot of cabling back there. It does a very good job at hiding. Voila! So when you first set it up, you have to uh, set up your display. So right now one and two means this one and that one are duplicating. So now you have to extend display right now. So I have to turn off this display. So this is um, one, that's two, three, four, five. So two, three, four, five, apply, and one, disconnect the display. Go to choose when I turn off the display or choose when I close the lid. So right now on battery it sleeps and on uh, plug-in it sleeps. So you want to do nothing. 
and then now you can turn this off without affecting your screens. So this scenario would work. Uh, you would have your PC or your laptop, and this is your workstation, and you unplug it when you're done. And if you got a uh, laptop from work, If you got a laptop from work, you just place it on here and then plug it in. And you're able to use the mouse uh, because it's attached to the dock and you're able to use the audio because it's attached to the dock. All right, there you go and good luck. Um, hope you find everything all right. Thanks for shopping at monstermonitor.com.